Hey, my beautiful Scorpios, welcome to Phoenix Intuitions. So today, I just want to tap into the energy of what today holds. This is going to be timeless. So whenever you're watching this, this is going to be whatever your day holds. Messages of love and life for our beautiful Phoenix. Today, we have the four pinnacles. Today, we're going to be holding back. I feel like we're going to be holding back our emotions from people people in the past people that are trying to resurrect things or situations i feel like you're going to be holding back monetary uh funds from people and situations as well right now we're in the energy of being guarded and it's not so much of guarding because we're afraid to move forward it's guarding to protect our hearts because in whatever situation that we're that that you're currently in, I feel that uh, the person or situation uh, either I want to say misused your trust or took something for granted, and now we're in this energy of holding back to protect our very uh, our heart. Our feelings our um, you know our ability not to put you on the fuck you list <laughs> yeah it was something that happened in the past that you like I don't know I, I don't know if I could trust you with this and then we have the six of Pentacles. yeah somebody wasn't given in this past situation you're holding back because somebody wasn't given we have the six of pentacles, so it was e it wasn't an equal give and take. I feel like this could deal with finances, and this can deal with also emotions. It's like uh, Scorpio, you could have been given to a situation uh, more emotionally than someone else, or more financially than someone else, and it started to get imbalanced. And then in your recent past, which is like your 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 energy that you are in currently. Um, for today is that you're holding back because you're like, nah, at this, like I said, 2021 is action and we're putting forth action. And I feel like you saw a situation, you saw how someone, um, didn't handle you correctly. So it's like now you're setting up those healthy boundaries. Now you start to put up those little blocks, you know. And then with the six and a four, that's a 10. So this was dealing with a, with the, uh, uh, I feel like a, a family or a kingdom building dynamic because four, four and six, that's the 10 of Pentacles. So you were, you were this person you were expecting to build something with. You were expecting, uh, like businesses, you were expecting, uh, um, a good family ship prosperity. You, like this was like, like this person that you're, or the situation that you're dealing with, you wanted a long term thing with contract, and for some of you guys today, um, I feel like today the person that you were holding back from could be trying to come in to give to the situation now. Because once you pull back your energy and it was so abrupt, I feel that it was like once you realize it, it was like you snapped into that to that mode quick. you like, uh-uh, mm, energy back. Get over here. <laughs> And I feel like you pulled your energy energy back so quick that it took the person by surprise because because you were giving this whole time, you know. Yeah, I feel like this person probably didn't, and then wasn't taking action. So we have the five of wands, Scorpio. This is conflict and competition. I feel like you guys had petty arguments in the past, and that was another reason why you started pulling back. I feel like. Scorpio, Phoenix, I feel that you were the one that was kind of, um, you were the one that was giving, you were the one that was loving, you were the one that was trying not to keep these, these, uh, you know, the competition going because it's like you already knew where it was going. It's like, I can read your mind. I know what angle you're thinking that this is going. But, you know, so it's like what we do is because we already know where one situation could go. We we actively work for the opposite. It's like 
at this point in our life, Phoenix, we don't, we don't have no time for no drama. If it's not elevation or, or continually um, transforming, we're not really... It, it, it's not it's not getting our attention so it's like when we cut so i feel like somebody was feeding this drama somebody was kept wanting to have arguments like somebody was being petty betty yes and i feel like it was your person phoenix because we don't be on that petty shit no that's the lower vibrational you know what i'm saying we, we elevated baby you gotta get on our level <laughs> But yeah, I feel like uh, somebody was was aiding in these uh, in these arguments, putting their putting their self, their mindset in this conflict type of energy, and therefore they when they stop giving emotionally, they start giving their energy to things of drama. This could be um, listening to other people or just it, it, it's like it's petty. And then we have the king, we have the king of cups and the two of wands. Yeah, this person was on guard. I feel like Scorpio, it could have you could have had conversations with this person in the past just about things that needed to change or or you being who you are um kind of triggered things in them that they knew they would have to change if they continued a relationship with you. It could be unbeknownst to you. You couldn't even know anything about it. It's just the way that we carry ourselves. It's the way that we act. It's the way that we evolve. That when you're around us and you see us continually doing better or you see that we are ahead in certain aspects than you are, then that triggers you to have to tap in and do better and i feel like this was where, where the conflicts and arguments was coming in but to clear what were the conflicts and argument about we have the king of cups in the two of wands this was somebody that did not show that they loved you this is somebody that has a lot of deep feelings for you and i don't feel like they really voiced that uh scorpio and then not just that but they were trying to figure out how which way to go it's like this person was trying to figure out a path to 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 sh let you know that they love you but without making themselves vulnerable it's like how you do that you can't tell me you love me and not be in a vulnerable state to a certain degree and it's like this person was was still on guard trying to it's like okay i want to tell this person that i love them but i don't want them to hurt me so i'm gonna keep my guard up and i'm not you know this person wasn't moving but this person just sitting there admiring you from the side, just aiding in, in little arguments. It sounds like self-sabotage. So today, you know, and then we have the full card. So I feel like this person or whoever that you couldn't deal with today, they could reach out today. I feel like they're, they're, they are still on guard, but I feel like if they don't act today, I feel like they are really contemplating on on acting because with the with the fool it's like that whatever energy you guys are in now if you pulled your energy back scorpio they are missing it and now they want to give to the situation more than ever because they say uh scorpio don't pull their energy back i'm going crazy 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 just to thinking about you baby the empress card look the Empress and the Two of Pentacles. Yeah, this person was juggling the Empress. This person was was uh, yeah. We got the Six again. So this person was 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 focusing on other things and not the Empress. You know, like they were focusing on business. They were focusing on what other people were saying. This person was really focusing on the wrong thing. So when they took their their uh their energy off of the connection itself and start putting it on things outside of the connection then that's when things started that's when they start giving to other situations and not to your situation y'all situation so once you pull that empress energy back like everything you know they get addicted to the to us and then now they want to get that heck right yeah this person is very passionate Ooh. Okay, so the Ace of Wands card came on a pool. Your person finds you so, so very attractive. I mean, to the point to where the, I feel like you, this, whatever this was, as soon as you pulled your energy back, I feel like this immediately turned this person on. Like, I feel like, uh, uh, Scorpio, that you've probably been on a, like, you've probably been, like, giving this person, like, the sweeter side of you, and they really don't even know how you get down like they don't know how you get down 
And because you were giving them the sweeter side, it's like they were trying to test you just like kids. But as soon as you ch- I feel, feel, have a filler, but some of you Scorpios, like you haven't talked to this person like this before, but you have to check them. Like, first of all, you need to watch how you handle me, you know, because you don't know me. I, I, you know, I used to have a heavy hand back in the day. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like you have to remind this person of who you actually were and this turned them on. Now, because this is so close to the Empress, the Ace of Wands and the Empress, this is guaranteed pregnancy. So, and because it fell next to it side by side, I feel like for some of you guys, you and, your, you and this person could have talked about having kids or you could have talked about having kids with this person. And, um, and I feel like, you know, they could have been holding back like, no, nah, you know, do. but I feel like in this coming, this person wants to give you a child. And for some of you Scorpios, you might find out that you are already pregnant by this person. So pregnancy is very in this air is very potent. And uh, if you talked about kids, this person is thinking about putting a child in you or vice versa. Your, your person is thinking about having a child by you. It's very, very important because if the Empress is next to the wands, the Ace of Wands, it's guaranteed pregnancy. So somebody pregnant, you better count the fish or something. I don't know. Anyway, all right, Scorpios, I'm going to let this be. If you're your first of all, the channel, please like and subscribe. Hit that notification button if anything resonates. If you want to donate to the channel, all the information will be below. I love you guys. Love yourself.